You've been giving your instructions in the dressing room. Protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. We will have a clean fight. Touch gloves. Let's make it official. They touch him up, and we are underway. Ready. So lofty expectations for this matchup as round one gets underway. Seems to be a striking advantage on one side, but on the other, truly a fighter who can do it all. And that guy will usually have the advantage on paper. When you're a striker at this guy's level, that will normally balance out whatever advantage the other guy has. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one? Just out of the range with that right hand. You can really limit the mobility of your opponent with those leg kicks. Nice one-two combination there. He's the taller fighter and able to land a knee to the body with relative ease there. Oh, lands a stiff punch there. Nice connection. Oh, nice land. Right hook to the head block. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. So both guys landing at will here. Good action early. It was a good night if that landed. Oh, and he connects with a punch there, DC. You gotta like what you're seeing thus far. I mean, the speed at which he throws is crazy. Nice, sneaky head kick. Just over three minutes to go. Right hook to the body. Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. Able to check that kick as well. Ooh, what a punch. Powerful leg kick land. Oh, and yet another knee finds the target. So a huge moment here. Now we'll see if he can follow it up. Back and forth we go! And he landed the right hand there. Big head kick lands. Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. Oh, nice job landing the knee there. He's got a lot of size for this division and put it to good use there. Very tricky when he throws that body kick. Big ball punch lands. Now he gets back to range. Big leg kick lands. Nice kick. Just misses with a left hook there. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. Left punch followed by a right. Nice one-two there by Lee. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. Ooh, what a head kick. Beautifully timed and placed kick there by Lee. Oh, he landed that kick to the outside of the lead leg there, DC. He is chopping up that leg. They say chop down the tree. You beat your opponent by slowing him down first with those nice outside leg kicks. Ooh, head kick lands. He's hurt. Nice kick. Oh, 
is he a good counter striker? Counters beautifully with the left hand. And both fighters exchange in the pocket. Nice punch there by Lee. He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. Oh, how about that? He lands a huge kick. Can't take many of those, you better check. How about those five minutes? Stop, stop, stop. Right, let's take a look back at some of the highlights from those previous five minutes, DC, and uh, no padding, no glove on that foot. No glove, no padding, and look at the hip action when he throws those kicks. He's not only kicking just for feel, he's really trying to damage his opponent, and as the fight goes longer, you will start to see it taking effect. All right, here we go as our next round gets underway. His strong leg packs so much power that even when he doesn't throw it full throttle, you see he's able to inflict damage. We'll see if he can keep it going here in this He round. doesn't. The biggest shot of the fight thus far. How's his opponent still standing? I mean, I have no idea. This fight is supposed to be over. And it might not be over now, but it's gonna be over very soon. Oh, a huge block there. Big kick lands. Oh. All right, so he's landed some good shots. You hate to be overly critical, but nothing really in terms of combinations tonight. Well, the jab has been looking great. But how about jab, jab, right hand? Right. Because eventually you're going to have to put something on your opponent that's going to really make him pause. I believe the jab has been working so well, if he drops a big right hand after it, he may be able to finish this fight. Head kick lands. Nice. I mean, he's cutting them down to size with these beautiful legs. And both guys really throwing with authority. Well, he has certainly found the range and staying pretty busy here on the feet. He's being busy, but it's also the timing and the accuracy that's allowing him to land so many attacks. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Oh, nice knee to the body. Just what he needed there. Game of inches right there, boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Nice punch there by Lee. Already closes the distance, gets the single collar tie. Trying to establish that jab once again. Oh, right there. I'm not sure his opponent knows where he is. No, he is on Beach Street right now. He's seeing Tweety Bird over the top of his head. When you take a hook like that, you are on wobbly legs. Man, as he landed a high volume of strikes here in round two, definitely picking up the pace after round one. So he got the message from the corner, and now he is taking control of this second round. And they separate. Oh, he tags him with the straight hand there. Nice job by Lee. Just missed with the leg kick. Look at how he turns his hip over when he throws that kick. was lightning fast, that right hand. Lee gets caught with that punch. He's treading water now. Got to find a way to move those feet. Oh, man. This is one thing you, you do not want to get kicked in the head at MMA. You cannot take too many of those head kicks. But this guy gets his leg up there so fast, sometimes you don't see it coming. Oh, nice. Oh, and he lands another strike to the body. Not a ton of real estate there, but he certainly found it. Straight punch lands. Look at the force behind that leg kick. Beautiful body kick. Torso, specifically that right side, has absorbed a lot of damage tonight. And here comes the purple, the black, and blue. A definite bruise starting to fill him on that right side. 
Well, he's doing a nice job here blocking these shots. The chin is tucked, the hands are high. Pretty good job defensively thus far. Great job defensively. He's seeing everything coming. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection. And these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. Just out of range with that right hook. Slips the left hand. I mean, look at the commitment to kicking in this fight. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. 20 seconds left. You got to check these low leg kicks. 10 seconds remain in round two. Beautiful head kick. Oh, big punch land. And the horn sounds on round two. All right, well, that's the end of the round, so the location is okay, the cut on the cheek, but that is some serious blood trickling out of that cut there. You gotta think maybe at some point they call the doctor in, and if he doesn't like what he sees, maybe they stop this fight. All right, well, his kicking game was outstanding in that round. We'll see if his opponent can make the adjustments, but take us through the replays before we get there. It's always weird to watch a young fighter start to come into his own. Early in his career, he did not have this ability. He did not have the ability to dictate and control fights with his legs. Now he does, and he looks like a future champion in the make. Oh, continuing to work the body to great effect. Lands with the kick there, no pad on that foot. No shit guard, he's taking all of that kick every time he throws it. Throws a big right hand, but doesn't find its home. Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. Tried to go to the body, but unable to connect. Slips the shot. He blocks the punch. Over and over, he's landing these big body kicks. Big punch land. Boom. Well, most fighters can't keep up this type of aggression and pace, but you don't have to worry about this guy. He hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. Oh, left hook to the head, it's blocked. Look at him drive his shin into his opponent's body with that body kick. Kick to the body now, that one won't land. Big kick. As he gets close, he's out of the kicking range, he'll, he'll change his stance. And they separate. Oh, and he caught the kick. You take more of these leg kicks, you will not be able to be very active on your feet. Oh, buckled him there. Beautiful shot to the body. Lee gets touched by that kick right to the body there. Nicely done by the opponent. Liver kick, if you take those kicks, it's going to shut your body off. lands a knee to the body now, DC. Talk to us about that strike. They suck so bad, especially when you're going forward. You walk full speed to a knee to the body, it could in the night. Lee gets caught with that punch. There's no tell on that leg kick. Well, no surprises, he connects once again, and that looked like it landed right on that. Right on the cut, and he's targeting it, right? He's looking, you can see him almost putting a laser beat on that cut and just putting his hands on it. It doesn't take much, it's just keep making it split, showing his opponent that he has no mercy. Oh, Superman punch, not always easy to execute, he did so there. Well, this is exactly the sense of urgency you're looking for, try to take the judges out of it. He is lighting them up now. Nice leg kick land. Strong defense there to block the shot. Nice instincts. Oh, 
Single collar tie now. Oh, he to the head. And there comes the separation now. Nice strike. Beautiful spot he keep land right under the elbow. Head off the center line, slips the punch. Big liver kick lands under the elbow. Real quick leg kick. Right hand on point. Big, big head kick home, and now his opponent in a world of trouble. Such a sneaky head kick. He did not recognize it was coming high, and now he's got him hurt bad. Well, he has certainly kept the punch counters busy tonight. He's left. Oh! What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Go finish this fight. Oh, wow! Head kick. A oh, really good job by him there to raise the guard, DC, and block those shots coming his way. He does a great job of blocking all incoming strikes. Beautiful punch. Nice head kick. And that'll do it, 15 minutes in the books. All right, now we take a look back at some of the highlights he has had his kicking game going early and often tonight. I mean, on point, right? He knew that this was going to be a way for him to take control of this fight. He's used those kicks to really put him out ahead, and I'm not sure if his opponent has the ability to adjust and stop him from landing these over and over. All right, DC, here we go with our next round, and we'll see if he can pick up where he left off. High volume of strikes landed in the previous round. High volume of strikes landed. He was able to be accurate, but also very, very active in his approach to the start of this fight. Punches in bunches, and he hasn't really shown any signs of slowing down here tonight. I'm not sure how much more his opponent can take. Oh, and he caught the kick. Digging kick. to his patented kicks here, but just out of range. Looking to land the right hand, he misses. Oh, that right hand is on point. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. Liver kick. Cable inches right there, boy, wow. It was a good night if that landed. Punch over the top. Oh, nice knee of the body. Very nice. He understands that doing the body work will pay dividends the longer the fight goes. Lee's all sorts of bruised up on his body. That is going to hurt something fierce tomorrow. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Just out of range with that left hook. Lee gets caught with that punch. He'd be wise to get those hands up. Superman punch. Just over three minutes to go now. Timely defense there. Huge block for him. Oh, spinning back. He didn't telegraph that one at all. Beautiful strike. Big leg kick lands. Yeah, he's mixed it all up. Lee's punch to the body is blocked, so no damage done there. Still unable to find that precise range with the high kick. be on his feet right now. Nice job.
power behind that head kick. Lands to the body there. Good punch, Lance. Nice body kick. Oh, combination lands. You want to talk about putting strikes together. Beautiful execution. And every one of them are landing. He's overwhelming him with different attacks. Leg kick. Left hand counter. Oh, he lands the Superman punch. Huge block there. Well, not much of a setup there. Misses with the left hook. Ooh, what a punch. Well placed with the kick. Just missing on the high kick there. Just oh, the top. This fight's gonna be over this. What a great way of mixing up his attack. He didn't stay the court. He mixed it up. He went high with his opponent, thought he was going low, and now he's got him hurt very badly. Oh, well, that's a good strike there by Lee. And they separate. It's such a fast leg kick. Oh, beautiful jab by him there. Got that to the target quickly. He's dictating the fight with a jab. Tags him with the uppercut. Oh, he lands the Superman punch. How about it? All right, so a huge round for him there. His opponent will need Motrin tomorrow. Huh. A lot of head kicks in that previous five minutes. He took way too many head kicks. He was trying to go forward. He was trying to pressure. And when he was doing that, he was carrying his hands low. And his opponent was just wrapping that kick up and over the side of his guard. Credit to his opponent for finding this shot, but really bad on him for not really making the adjustment to stop him. Nice jab, follows it up with a nice right hand. Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. And they separate. Slips that left hand. He has a commitment to kicking tonight, and it shows. He lands a punch there. Pretty good connection by him. Great connection. He's in a great flow right now. Just missing on the uppercut there. Lee going for the leg kick. Nothing doing there. Leads with the right punch. Establish that jab. Liver kick, if you take those kicks, it's gonna shut your body off. Ooh, big shot land. Lands the right hand. Big kick lands. Three minutes now to go in this one. All right, well, it's late in the fight. Time is of the essence, and when you're clearly losing and you know you need a finish, risk management goes out the window. Oh, yeah, no more risk management. Either get knocked out or you knock him out. One way or the other, 
you're going to lose. You can lose by decision or you can lose by knockout. But at least when you go for the knockout, you give yourself a chance to try to find your shot. Oh, oh, there is he lands, and maybe time to get the bonus checks ready. I mean, this fight is about done. He's got to hurt very bad with his head kick. Now he has to find one more strike to end the night. Head kick attempt. It's blocked. Good punch. Big liver kick lands under the elbow. Oh, that is a nasty inside leg kick, DC. It is a great technique, but it only takes one time to check it. Right. And your night could be over. Or you can end up like Anderson Silva. Be careful. Got an issue. Here's a tissue. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. Right under the elbow, the body kick lands. Throwing that jab, no good. So you gotta be careful playing on the ground with this guy. You don't wanna mess around for too long. Oh man, this ground and pound is good. Probably my favorite striking realm in MMA and he's as good as it gets. The problem is his opponent is not controlling his posture. He's allowing his opponent to get up and when he does, he creates this space to land these beautiful ground and pound combinations. This is some serious ground and pound. He's trying to put this dude's head like through the canvas. He's one of the better ground and pound fighters we have in the entire UFC, and you're seeing why. I mean, how many can he take? What a fight! All right, so the fighters go the distance here tonight, but it went a whole lot better for one of them than the other. Talk us through the replays, champ. Some decisions are different than others, and his striking really did separate him from the competition. He fought so well in the stand-up game that he should get a very easy decision. Official decision is in. Bruce Buffer has it. Ladies and gentlemen, after five rounds, we go to the judges' scorecards for a decision. All three judges score this contest. 50-44. For the winner, by unanimous decision, Bruce the Dragon!